How to set up yourself for writing when you don't feel like it? As a screenwriter or any kind of storyteller, you probably all have those moments that feel extremely inspired to write. That's when inspiration strikes on you. It might be an image or a kind of feeling that you just feel have to write on the paper. Otherwise, you might lose it. But often time, when we really set a schedule, make ourselves sit down and write. For some reason, you just don't feel like it. It's like inspiration is not visiting you. Your brain is like a dry desert; nothing come out of it. You will even questioning or doubting yourself. Am I really good enough for this? I think the truth is, everyone can write if they really want to, because we all have a different point of view. We see and feel things others might not. The problem with writer's block is your brain is not ready when you want it to be. I heard a lot of people suggest that you have to force yourself sit down and write daily, even when you don't feel like it. It doesn't really work for me because I feel if I force myself to write, I the writing process is not enjoyable anymore. Don't get me wrong; I still think you can write daily, write on schedule, or write when you need to write. I discovered throughout my screenwriting career. That all you need to do is to trigger your brain and、uh, ease it into the writing flow, which means to get inspired before you start writing. It's just like you need to dress yourself up before you go out to meet a friend, or you need a good morning routine in order to have a productive day. You need to set yourself into the story world before you start writing. There are a lot of ways to do this. Today, I want to share three top tips that I use to get my inspiration back when I need it to. But before I start it, I want to thank you for stopping by my channel. My name is Nani, and this channel is dedicated to filmmaking, screenwriting, directing. I hope you enjoy. First, absorb other stories. Of course, it doesn't mean to be a copycat. I just find this is the easiest way to get yourself ready to write. I always will have a collection of reference films and the screenplays ready before I start a new project. Usually, it will be three to five of them, and they all serve different purpose. It could be the character similar to mine, the dialogue is really inspiring, or The visual is close to what I'm trying to achieve. It could be any reason that you think it's helpful. Take 10 to 30 minutes. Watch several scenes from your reference film is really helpful, and I find that it's most effective when you watch the film and then read the screenplay at the same time. Sometimes I'll copy interesting sentences from the screenplay down to my notebook and make a list of them. Instead of watching the film, I might just read through those sentences over and over for several times before I start writing. Second, use other art object. I believe that different art medium can contribute to each other. So if you don't feel like writing, maybe you should turn on some music, doing some research on pictures and painting. It will boost your inspiration quickly. I noticed this when I was in film school. The class required us to make a presentation of our upcoming project. I did some visual research on the topic of my film. Soon, I felt sentimental and drawn in by the pictures. Those pictures inspired me and gave me some new ideas of the script. And also, I started using images to be my visual reference when I write in certain things. You can also create a music playlist for each project that you are working on. Ideally, you want those music have the same tone of the film that you are going to make. I highly recommend to try use film score because film score tend to have more story in them. It can really help you opening your imagination. Third, reading a good screenwriting book. This is the best tip to get the most out of your writing. 
I think writing is a process of creating and、um, learning and then recreating. We can never write perfectly on our first try. So I think it's crucial for me to have a screenwriting book by my hand while I'm working on a script, because it will help me to consider things that I might not have thought about. Some people read writing books, then set them aside, and then go to write. To me, writing book is more like a tool. You read it, and then you go to write, and then you reread certain chapters based on your story. And then you go to rewrite your story. It's like a loop. You do it over and over until you feel ready to present your writing to the world. Who knows? You might get inspired by some theory the book mentioned or some example the book gave. My favorite screenwriting book is *The Anatomy of Story* by John Truby. I'll link down below if you like to check it out. These are three things I would do before I start writing. Instead of forcing yourself to write and feeling writing is the most tedious work in the world, why not setting yourself up into daydreaming and enjoying the pleasure of creating? I hope those tips are helpful and it can give you some inspiration on your next project. I'm sure there are many more ways to get inspired for writing. How did you do it? If you have more tips. Please leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, and I will see you next time. Bye.